is has sung his way up to the top nine of One in a Million, season two, 2008. What is time? Is it the autumn leaves that change? Or the snow that floats from the sky? I'll be honest, I wanted to not like you. Because from the beginning, I have not liked you. But tonight's performance, I'm going to have to change my mind, okay? Since then, he had appeared on talk shows, radio interviews, covers, while keeping in touch with his fans through a strong internet presence, capturing the hearts of Malaysia with his voice and his distinctive fashion sense. In the next few minutes, we will share with you Iz's story beginning with his early involvement in music, and we will take you to his fight to stay in the limelight and to be recognized after One in a Million Two has ended. This is the story of Iz. As a young boy, he was in awe every time he witnessed the recording sessions at the old Buri studio in Jalan Pahang and grew up being surrounded by talented musicians such as the Buri Boys, Man Kidal and Roslan Aziz. These little experiences have fueled his huge interest in recording his own material and compile it into an album he hopes to one day produce. In the year 2002, at the age of 19, he enrolled himself in the prestigious Royal Melbourne Institute of Technology, RMIT. Whilst pursuing his undergraduate and postgraduate degree in advertising and cross-cultural communications, is had involved himself in various aspects of the advertising industry in Melbourne, as well as being an author on the subject of cross-cultural communications and directed a documentary on the same subject, while involving himself with Chamber Music Australia, a charity body for classical musicians under 35, and performed at various jazz club venues in Sydney, Melbourne, and Canberra, never realizing that one day, this would be his calling. Having experienced and achieved so much abroad, Iz decided to come back to Malaysia to audition for 8TV's One in a Million Season 2, armed with experience and knowledge he learned from his studies and life in another country. Although that was not enough to prepare him for the harshness of reality TV. This is just the start of my journey. I will produce my own album, my own songs, no matter what. I hope you guys will wait when that time comes. Although Iz was the fourth contestant to be eliminated, two days later, he jumped right back on the horse and started working on his debut single, Gonna Be Alright. Singing all the low, singing all the high. I know you need the answers for the questions right. So right now, we're recording Iz's ending rapping bit for the song, Gonna Be Alright. An inspirational number he wrote as a personal message to his fans to not take setbacks as failure, but instead take it as a lesson to do better in the future. With the release of Gonna Be Alright in March 2008, the song had even reached number two on Fly Fam's Jumper Chart and is enjoying airplay on local English radio stations in Malaysia, Singapore, and Australia. A Mandarin version was later recorded entitled Hui Hao Te. Bersama Together, also written by Iz, which features popular Malay actress Nora Danish, was later released as his second single for the Malay-speaking audience. He's very talented, so I sit up, okay? So, I'm first, so I sit up. <laughs> he debuted his single live on Malaysia Hariini and currently being played on local and Singaporean radios. Iz's seven-track EP was also released exclusively on Gua Music in July 2008, prior to his official release in stores nationwide, which is distributed by Sony BMG Malaysia. One in a Million Season 2 does not spell the end for Iz. Truly riding on the waves he has created during One in a Million Season 2, Iz has appeared in various local magazines, TV shows, telemovies, TV commercials, and various radio interviews while working on his first EP. All in the short four months after One in a Million Season 2 has ended. The singer with brains also made sure his fans did not rely on traditional media to be in touch with him, but takes advantage of the digital age in which his fans can be the first to be updated about Iz. This is only the beginning for this talented young man's journey in the music industry. As quoted by the star, the only way is up 